generic greetings and welcome to Spilled, today's beverages. A very standard, albeit very reliable, cup of tea. The good old cupper. So welcome to an extra shorter video for you today in the demo form of Spilled here. This is marketed as a relaxing, cosy, chill game about cleaning up ocean waste. Now, that in itself is a theme, interests me. And, well, let's just check the demo out. So we can move the boat to the left and right, and we do have the ability to uh, go forward as well. And the idea is we have to use this sort of scoop on the front to pick up these patches of I'm going to say oil but I mean it could be any form of contamination really and as we go around we'll uh, also meet I was going to say meet different characters but that's not true at least not in this demo form uh, that I found and now basically we're going to clean up this stuff and we can now start seeing a bit more into the uh, into the waters there and we can see we've got like is that a clownfish on the right we've got some coral there's some other stuff going on and the idea essentially is we have to clean this up and um we'll also find different animals as well i'm just going to go over to this barge here and what we do is drop off the stuff we've collected and that gives us some coins which we can spend on one of three upgrades and we're also going to meet something here ah there's a nice frog and I'm just checking out the scenery. We've got like a sort of broken boat there. We've got a bridge, some logs, and some nice scenery there. Obviously, I'm seeing a lot of green energy as well. We've got a solar on the boat. In fact, by the sound of it, it's electrically powered. I mean, it would make sense being the theme of the game. Oh, hang on. There we go. It looks like we get to a certain point, and that opens up the next area. Yeah. I'm seeing uh, wind turbines. I'm seeing solar panels. And, oh, I'm seeing... Is that a swan? It's seems to make its uh, home this patch of oil or is it guarding it are we um are we going to get attacked because oh, it's going to break an arm this thing isn't it no okay there we go we've um managed to collect the swan and oh we've got a nice little campsite at the uh at the top there oh the boat does not turn as i expected it to turn uh, going backwards with having a rudder and such although actually if i remember rightly uh yes you can uh, reverse your backwards movement there okay um <laughs> i don't know if it's actually correct or not I is it is it uh, uh i don't know anyway it doesn't matter we'll get used to it so i'm going to drop this stuff off and we're going to get an upgrade now i'm not too sure what sort of upgrade we're going to get we've got three options we've got uh boat speed i'm guessing with the additional solar there we've got uh, oil or contamination capacity Oh, there's the one I'm going to get here, which is the slightly bigger frontal scoop. And that's all we can really get at this stage. So let's uh, motor out and we'll head to the next area, which again is obviously all contaminated and whatnot. So we're going to have to clean all this up and do what we can. And oh, we've got a nice little cave here with some some fungus and such. We've got, was that a turtle there, I think? Uh, and there's obviously another barge here as well. Oh, looks like we've missed this bit. Can we go back over? Ah, yes, you, you don't. You don't have to drive forward into that. You can just literally put the scoop over that. And Oh, it looks like we have uh, completely filled up. So, oh, it's also giving us a little bit of a tip on how to collect these... What are these? Oh, is this pl just plastic bottles and such? I think it is. Oh, and apparently they're worth quite a bit of money because we did get a bit of money there. Interesting. Okay, what I'm going to do then, I'm going to... I think I'm actually going to get this scoop. I'm going to get the bigger scoop because we've got the bottles here. And if I can scoop up this oil and scoop up all the bottles... And are they individually simulated? They are. Okay, that's interesting. That's pretty good. Nice little added touch there. And uh, we're going to collect the bottles. Just feathering the throttle there. I think I've missed one of the bottles. Okay, let's just let's just power through and we'll get these two where they need to go. They also have some, some momentum as well. So there is actually a little bit of a challenge in, uh, in getting this thing. So... There we go. I did notice as well uh, that we've got further down here, I think it was, well, what was it? Some sort of, again, another animal, and, oh, we're completely full, so we're going to have to go, oh, we're going to have to go back. Okay, actually, no, we don't have to go back. We could very easily go and get an upgrade in the form of, well, probably the capacity. Actually, we can get capacity and speed, so let's do that. There's capacity and there is speed and because of that we're also able to pick up this little bit of uh, contamination here and then we're just going to drop that off do some donuts crash into the rock and then continue on and there's a big eagle that's just went overhead obviously a lot of the actually i just realized how big the turtles are underwater they're about we're rather in a very small boat although some really big turtles uh and that's a duck and a campsite as well on the 
on the left hand side. Or would it be the left hand side? Would it be uh, starboard from our current uh, facing? And there we go. Yeah, there's some very big turtles. Did uh... <laughs> is that is that Discworld the great tattoo in one? <laughs> uh, yeah, that's. <laughs> <laughs> Quite large. A bit distracting, actually. But anyway, let's um, clean up the rest of this. And there we go. We'll drop this off. And then, basically, I'm guessing if we do these little bits... Oh, I've missed a section there. But we can come back. It's not too much of an issue. Yeah, there we go. There's a another area opening up. So we're just going to uh, sort of scoot around here and finish this one up. So there we go. And we've got... A last section. I'm noticing there's like a reserve tank on the the back of this barge here, and I wonder if like there's literally yeah. Do you, is there any bonuses for full completion? It doesn't look like there is. Okay, so we do have 46 generic units of currency, which I will uh, firstly crash into that, and then secondly we're gonna probably go back over here. I I, I don't I don't feel that the speed is like an issue. That what we really need is capacity as well as the. Uh, as well as the ability to scoop all this in one go. Another bit of tutorial here, and it appears we've now got a a water cannon where we can oh we can wash off the wash off the contamination on the rocks there. And there's a, a bridge going to nowhere. <laughs> all right. So what we'll do is we'll come down here, and I think we're going to be yeah we're going to be full, aren't we? And we've got these bottles, so I'm just going to go to here. I'm going to reverse round and. And uh, see, so yeah, what I was trying to do is be clever and, and get all of the bottles in one go. But actually, what I've done is the exact opposite, and that's just basically push them around. So let's just uh, push these in, and we should be able to get these in. This is gonna this is gonna give us loads of money, isn't it? Oh yeah, there we go. That's um, that's a brilliant amount. Okay, that's fine. And what we'll do is we'll go and uh, I'm gonna have to push those to there. I'm going to back up to. I mean, realistically, I'm gonna the the rudder's gonna mince the whatever that is. Is that a beaver or was it like a? I'm not too sure what it was, but we are full uh, of of this oil contamination -y stuff. So we'll go over here and we'll drop that off. And I do feel it's probably time to get an upgrade. Just looking at underwater as well, lots more, um, lots more wildlife. Oh, good grief, that's a. Okay, it's almost like a combined harvester of the seas now, and <laughs> it's fairly large. I tell you what we're going to do. We're going to, because we can... Um, oh, I just realised that person who's got some sort of dwelling on the side of the hill has got like a full... They've got their own solar farm going on. Good for them. And let's just get that upgraded. And that feels like that's about where we need to be. Uh, it looks like the, the, the collection system on the front, it doesn't have a, a hitbox, so like we're not... If that was if that was so, we'd end up. Well, put this way, we'd uh, probably end up just ripping it, <laughs> ripping it off. And uh, let's go over here to empty that. And uh, with that amount of money, are we able to get an upgrade? We are able to get an upgrade. I don't know if we want speed, but I think what we'll do is we'll get capacity, just because I don't really want to come back to the to the other bit. There we go. Okay, so we've got some bottles. Oh, we've got also this here as well. So we need to we need to wash that off. So we'll do that. We're going to go around these. Oh, I do think we're going to be coming back, aren't we? Let's just spray all of that. And, yep, there we go. That comes in to here. And then we'll come down. And we've got something else here as well, which is... Oh, there's that opened. And, oh, end of demo. Okay, so that's us there. But what we're going to collect, that is... Ah... A rat. Okay. And there's again some more high-rise dwellings with some garden rooftops as well. Very nice. Alright, so the last little push then to to get to the end. And we've got all of these bottles, which we're going to just burn straight for this thing. And there we go. Okay, that's going to give us all of the funds. And I guess with those funds, we might as well just get a better engine before we leave. And there we go. Um, oh, good grief. Okay, it is genuinely a little bit faster than I expected now. Yeah, that, that goes. Okay. <laughs> mm. Alright, so, yeah, we you can certainly, uh, you can certainly, you certainly don't need multiple beverages to finish the demo. Okay, I'm just having a quick look around here to see what we've got in terms of the scenery. And just some nice, just some nice, uh, trees and some logs on the left and it oh, looks like to be some sort of uh, allotment that's growing I think carrots on the very 
bottom left there. Anyway, we're going to go on to the next area, which is going to end the demo there. So there we are. That is the demo of Spilled. Thank you so much for trying out the demo. If we haven't met yet, I am Lent, Lente. I apologize in advance and profusely for uh, butchering the pronunciation of the name. I live on a boat and I'm working on Spilled full time. Subscribe to my newsletter if you want updates on the development of Spilled and occasional boat life updates and more. So yeah, there you go. That is the very short demo of Spilled, but I think you get what the game's putting down really it's a yeah fairly chill serene uh, title about driving a little boat around and collecting stuff up i mean personally i would like more meat on the bone more mechanics as it were more maybe puzzle stuff and more things to explore and find obviously that it may be represented later on as we unlock more stuff this is after all the demo so you never know but i always like to check out these quirky little things just as a little extra video because well why not because someone might find it interesting and fun and get something out of it nothing wrong with a little relaxing title either way if you like we see links in the description and uh, let me know what you think as always comments in the comments thanks very much for watching take care and generic partings